More traffic authority coverage now as a vote is expected today in the U.S. House on President Biden's stimulus plan. Leaders are already turning to another top priority, improving the nation's transportation system. Our Samuel King joins us now, and Samuel, a new survey outlines some top priorities here and across the country. Yeah, about infrastructure, transportation, and the like, and a key familiar name is behind it to many people here in San Antonio. This study was done by the Kinder Institute for Urban Research over at Rice University in Houston in collaboration with former San Antonio Mayor and U.S. HUD Secretary Henry Cisneros. They looked at infrastructure priorities in 100 metropolitan areas and 134 cities across the country. And in San Antonio, Antonio leaders told them that one key priority is expanding and improving the transit system. Now, via Metropolitan Transit will benefit from a reallocation of local sales taxes beginning in 2026, but it will still lead federal funding, likely need federal funding, to help pay for an advanced transit system. Cisneros tells me expanding transit would reduce congestion and give people other options to get around as the region grows. And he says the pandemic also exposed the need for better transit options for essential workers. We can uh, move uh, essential workers who do not own a car uh, to work. That's an equity question. Uh, we can uh, get congestion off the roadways and improve people's time to work and so forth. The Cisneros says leaders also told them that road improvements are a key priority, at least in the short term. That major 35 project was one of the major projects on the local list of infrastructure priorities. Now, local leaders also listed improvements at the airport and Port SA on their wish list, as well as new investments in CPS and SAWS facilities. Cisneros says the winter storm showed just how dependent we are on infrastructure and the problems that are caused when it fails. Mark, Stephanie.